Hello and welcome to a two-minute tour of artwork in Lake Ontario Hall on GVSU's Allendale campus. This building is home to the Brooks College of Interdisciplinary Studies, which includes programs like writing, integrative religious and inter intercultural studies, LGBTQ studies, and women, gender, and sexuality studies, among others. This building is also home to the Padnos International Center, the Meyer Center for Writing and Michigan Authors, and one of the GVSU Art Gallery Department's wall galleries, which features two to three temporary exhibitions each year. Throughout the building, you'll find a mix of contemporary and international artwork that interacts with the space in unique ways and reflects the programs and offices in the building. Highlights include artwork that engage the body and identity, like this photograph by GVSU alum Michelle Klein-Hines that points to the problematic history of depictions of women in art. And this painting by Syrian Lebanese artist Rana Shalabi titled Dancing with the Sticks, Music in the Farafra Oasis. These two works created by Stephanie Ninehouse to honor late writing department faculty member Mary Easter mimic the movement of the wind through the trees that can be seen in the ravines through the north side windows. Other works of art were selected to spark the imagination and reflect the interior world of the mind, like these etchings by Todd Freeman and this illustration by Shannon Harris, both GVSU alumni. Finally, walking through these halls, you'll notice a number of collaborative or interdisciplinary pieces that incorporate both art and writing, like these broadsides featuring poems by Patricia Smith and Tony Hoagland, designed by GVSU Associate Professor W. Todd Kaneko, in honor of the poet's 2009 campus reading. Thank you for watching this two-minute tour of Lake Ontario Hall. We hope you'll come see it in person. To see more work from the GVSU Art Collection, visit gvsu.edu slash artgallery.